Right then, along we go into Chatham, and as always, into a tower block, and let's surf the lift. But this lift has an anti-surfing device. No! This device is not actually surf god. Surf god actually uses a passive infrared sensor to detect any movement on top of lift. This one actually uses like infrared beams. It's actually using as like lift door safety edge, like the infrared beams you get down the lift doors, but converted so it runs sideways across the top of a lift. And if anyone stands in the way of the beams, the lift doesn't move. But it's not actually a very good device because unlike surf guy it doesn't permanently disable lift it times it after 60 seconds and yeah it's not that good because the infrared beam baby it doesn't cover the entire way across the lift you stand right at the back of the lift the lift will still move and as well as that notice you've got lift cables and some other stuff actually blocking the area of the infrared beam so the infrared beams are actually calibrated so it's used to having some areas always blocking the beams which means if you stand exactly where the cables are it doesn't detect you and as well as that if you had to like climb up the cables slightly like stand on the railings of this lift since the beams are quite low down you're just completely out of its way and it can't even see you, so this anti serving device is pretty pathetic.